It is now time for a stream that I must be quiet with since Jitters is sleeping about six feet from me, so yay for being energetic while being quiet. Also, hello Rhythm, I'm doing good, how about you? And another thing, I want to thank you Animorph59 for just subscribing with Twitch Prime. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, now then, I think I should do the thing where I play the game. But hey, I am now an affiliate. And that means that I can now receive subscriptions through Twitch. And I can also receive bits. So if you want to donate even a penny, I can gain that in support through this new program <clears throat> that I'm a part of. So that's the advantage of being an affiliate is that now I can get more support available to support me in doing this. You know, having fun streaming. So I think we can probably start the game now. If you can just excuse me and get my desktop all cleaned up. And there we go. Close this, close that. Don't do this, do that. Hold on. We're almost there. Wait for it. Wait for it. There it is. Come on, OBS, you can do it. Come on, show the thing. Do the thing. Seriously. Wait, come on, man. You, you need to do the thing. You gotta show. Okay. Let's try this. join the hive go to the above link for my server you will join the hive and be considered a buggy if you aren't already one in the chat so yeah I know you guys are awesome buggies in the chat anyways always So let's get back to doing the thing. Alright, I think that might be where we should be. So, if you last recall, we were needing to go and help Undyne the Elemental of Water. But I did a little thing before I started the stream, and that was I went to get the Boomerang 
uh, upgraded through Watts, and now it's the Chakram, so now I have the Sprite Popoy using it because, well, he needs a ranged weapon because he doesn't have much HP. Now then, let's go save Undyne. Not to be, you know, related to the fish from Undertale. And now, there are fish here. They are ifish. They're offensive. Now we enter the cave. Yeah, you just gotta kinda knock these guys out if they don't knock you out first. Gotta help heal the little sprite. Gotta keep your allies alive. Always a good thing. And but hey, what's this? It is a ton pole. It just has those soulless eyes. Rude. Oh, but now it's more serious because he's a biting lizard. Can I get another candy for Popoy? Dodging. How dare. So rude. No, he has to use the freaking cure water. He's gotta heal himself from being attacked so dang much. I mean, it's not like, I don't know, he had this coming or something. I have no idea, it's just, it's a hero's journey. Doing damage slowly but surely. So rude. Damn it, I missed. Swung, then I missed. Then I swung, then I missed. And then they got him. Got gloves orb. And Popoy is leveled up. And here's Undyne. Thank you, I am Undyne, the elemental of water. My power is your reward. I'll give you two kinds of magic. Prim may use my recovery and defense magic. Popoy may use my battle magic. Yay, magical casting powers. And me? Your mana sword will one day become more powerful than any magic I can give you. However, you can receive an elemental's power, such as an ice saber, on your sword. Prim can cast Ice Saber on your weapon to turn enemies into snowmen. And this 
Take this with you. It is one of the mana weapons. Receive Poldart. Call me anytime. Gained Undyne's powers. Now I can stop me now. Now do we head for Pandora to save Dalek and Gemma first? Or do we start back for the underground palace and the Earth Seed to help Popoy? Well, I think we can probably go to the underground palace and see. Although I did forget something with uh, Pandora, so we probably could go back to Pandora. Gotta do this to level up. Gotta get those fish. Gotta do it, gotta do it. Shit a little. Shit, shit. Let's check on Luca first. Let's see if she says anything different. I'll restore you. Do you want to save the game? Because it knows it's a game. Because she knows this is only a game. Life is but a game. Yeah. Use Undyne's power to stop the lava in the underground palace. Crystal orbs are made to respond or react to an elemental's power. But let's go to Pandora first. See what's happening over there. Freaking steps making me stop. I am looking forward to seeing this game in 3D. And away he goes. Now, I won't go to Neko's just yet to get some of the fairy walnuts, because those are expensive right now. But, we'll go see what we can do over in Pandora. Knocked him out. Oh, he's gone. Kicking some butt. And there was one little detail I forgot to check in on, and that was in this house. Grandma's gone seeing and I won't say a thing. Now my granddaughter Fana is, is a Fana. Fana is acting funny too. What's wrong with them? Well, let's go see where Fana is. Prim. Huh? Fana? What's, what's the matter? Da 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 da. Hey, don't you hate when the pathfinding just decides to go all wonky and get your buddy in the middle of a freaking wall? 
freaking wall. God dang. I need to explore a little more first because I remember I need to talk to the king or at least check on where Gemma was. At least that's my only idea for what we can get to do so we can get things moving forward. What a nightmare. The people in my country are acting like zombies. Oh, I have a headache. I'm going back to my room for a nap. And they make their way to the bedroom. Oh my. Oh dear, what and how this has been such a peaceful country. Oh dear, why didn't you try to calm down a bit? This is a tragedy. We absolutely cannot allow the Empire to invade at a time like this. Okay, he doesn't say anything different. This is the first time I've seen the king looking so troubled. Yeah. Pretty troublesome. Now, let's see if there's anything different with Fana or the temple at all. is best and I'm homebound well that doesn't change anything well if this doesn't work yeah, we're gonna go to that underground palace. Time to go the other way. I noticed the uh, bit glass. It's kind of... Well, it's a little bit opaque and making the text hard to read in some places. <sighs> oh, nothing I can do. Oh, whoops. Yeah, it'll come back. Eh, yeah, let's get back to the game. Let's see if the father says anything different. Our grandfather. Well, nothing different here. Ugh. Yeah, let's go to the underground palace. God dang it. Yeah, let's grind a little bit, rather than taking a shortcut. Also, we have an orb anyway, so we can probably get that thing upgraded. Get the glove to its next orb level. There we go. Going nice and fast. Ooh, nice hit.
And away he goes. There we go. Boomerang reached level one. Medical air bone fit. Oh well. Yeah, I'm kind of curious if the new Secret of Ramana remake will actually be able to be modded. So, like, if there's something you wanted to make similar to the old game, like, I don't know, make movement faster, you can do, like, a mod or something. Candy! Oh, yeah, nothing's over there. Let's knock him out. And away he goes. Yeah, smack that sword in your hand. Make it like you are the man. Yeah. But the hero is just a boy. Let's see if Kippo Village has any items I can get. For nice and cheap. that. Get this. Get this. And this. Alright, we're good. For now. Gotta be sure you can revive your buddies in case anyone goes down. Always important. stuck on things. It's weird. Yeah, you can't poke him from up here. Kind of what happens. There we go. Knock out the buzz. Getting buzzed. Come on. Kick your frickin' butt. Kick your frickin' buzz butt. Yeah, yeah. Kicking some buzz butt. Going down this long thing of stairs. Okay, which one's ready? These. Now it's a power glove. Very popular in the 90s. Or 80s, whichever. Power glove, I think, was the 90s. Or was it the 80s? Yeah. It was Nintendo. It was one of them. It was one of the eras. see what items we can get. Let's buy. Uh, nothing different. So how much MP? Okay, both at 11. So let's save, just in case anything happens. Probably anyways. 
So yeah, and we'll just do that thing. Oh, come on, Prim. Time to use some ice magic. Yeah, we did it. These dudes wake up easily. And they're a pain in the butt. And they're using our magic too. Frick. Damn. These guys always were a pain in the butt. Doing this just to get some more levels or not. I think like it still hit him when I was itching my face. <laughs> Big spooky doors. Pretty much level twelve. Oh shit! Get the chest knight. He's a pain in the butt. Oh boy. Using his freaking magic. Oh, freaking cheap. Freaking damn spam. something. Well, that'll work for a moment. Alright. There's a switch. We can do it. We can get through this. Poor boy reaches level 11. There we go. Here we go again. There we go. And there's the green blob. Green drop. Whatever. You know what I meant. Up we go. Down we go. Kicked his butt. Jump the gap. Away we go. I'll undo that at least once. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Shiver me timbers. Oh my god. Frickin' hell.
Yeah, we need to level up some more. something good. Power wrist? What did the power wrist do? I don't remember. Oh, it's another one of these. <sighs> Boomerang Ridge is level 2. Oh, gotta change his action. Go to level two. Oy. Need to get some healing. Need to get some more healing and revive items. Hey, Mika Spider, how's it going? Welcome to a current whisper stream since my boyfriend is asleep. This will be a little quiet for a bit. I'm not sure how long. But Jitty hasn't had sleep in two days, so he's finally getting some sleep. So, that's good. Knocked you out. an enemy somewhere other than here. Come on. There we go. Knocked him out. Oh, I'm sorry you're sick there, Mecca. Hope you feel better soon. So this is kind of one of those points where Secret of Mana is like a little bit grindy. Because difficulty just ramps up. Let's get some of this. 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 There we go. There we go. Go to the inn. And there we go. Yeah, let's heal up a little bit and get everything restored. But soup is so tasty. Soup is good. up some more. Dang it, Prim. 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 Come on. Seriously. I think Rhythm's trying to say T. Booyah. Oh yeah, we could sold that power wrist. Yeah. No. If 
freaking chest knight. Get you. Yeah. Kick this butt. Oh, crap. Yeah. Gonna kick your nightly. Bootay. Yeah. Gotta take something to help yourself get better and you'll help you get better faster. Let's wait for him to spawn a few of the goblins. Oh damn. Bad idea. Yeah. Whack. Whack a whack a whack a mole. If only you could shoot in the next f direction. Or th throw in the next direction with the boomerang. But that'll probably be possible in the Secret of Mana remake. Yay, Popo reached level 12. Do this. Get the sword back. Yeah, getting whacked. Pow, 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 right in the kisser. Yeah, booyah. Gonna smack you. Green drop face. Yeah, level 13. Now we get prim leveled up. At some point or another. We're getting better. Booyah. Booyah, come on. There, now we got Prim leveled up. What do you have? Oh, crap. Well, that was nice. Ooh, 60 GP. Oh, great. Two chest knights. Frickin' speed up. Cheap shh. Oh, fuck. Damn. Freaking kicked my ass.
Ay, ay, ay. Well, that's just plain fun. Let's get back to a little more leveling up. There we go. Too close. Hey, there we go. Yeah, 60 GP. Let's trek back. Do a little more grinding. something out. Frick. Eh. Yeah. Gotta smack this knight and do a checkmate. But oops, did I do that? There we go. We'll get him. There we go. We got him. Kick this butt. At least let him spawn a little. There we go. Some of that magic. There we go, what the spawners. Glitchy, stinking drop. Nope. Now I have to get the thing. Oops, did I smack you with the whip? Yes, I did. have to cast twice. Hey. Got him. Gotta get that loot. Another power rest. Back. 
And what do you have? Candy that won't fit. Oh, screw your speed up. How do you speed up? You can't go faster. You can't go faster as a knight. Knights can only move in L's and they can only go three spaces. You freaking cheater. Freaking cheater. God dang cheater. Gotta can't have a cheater. Twenty GP, alright. You're asleep, you can't be throwing things at me. There we go. Smack your face. I will say, I do really hope that the Secret of Mana remake has online multiplayer, because what's the point of having it on Steam if it's not going to be multiplayer? Like, to different computers, not like just at one computer, you know? How much of the items do we have? Two, four, and four. Let's get that replenished. Oh, got a lot of GP. Uh, no, the, uh, not this game directly. Since it's, this is an emulator, I'm playing on Z SNES. But there will be a Secret of Mana remake that will be released on Steam, PS4, and Vita at digital release. It's a remake of this game. I mean, I hope that they have the cut content when they do remake the game. Since about 40% of the content was cut for the story and 60% of the graphic content. 60% of the graphic content get cut. Hold on a moment. You okay? You over? Good afternoon. Okay. I got my scarf off my neck a little bit since I think I'm sweating a little. Either that or it's the frickin' weather. So, let me readjust some things. Okay, is that better? Uh, there we go. Okay. Oh, too much. All right. You goober. Yeah, that was jitty being a gooberlicious butt. Gubalicious nut butt. So, now I can talk in regular volume. And it's still dark in the bedroom. I should probably do something about that. Unless you guys don't mind me being in the dark. Yep. Now let's trek through the underground palace once more. Hey, Nightfire. Uh, I don't play D&D &D currently. But I probably would end up doing it online, given different friends who have it. But everyone's a distance away, so I can't play D&D &D traditionally as much as some people can. So we're just kind of digital. You know, that muxy thing is bugging me. I need to fix that real quick. 
Excuse me a moment. So, give me a sec, and I'll have this figured out. Shouldn't take much more than a minute. Nope, that's not it. Nope. There we go. Oh. God dang it. Well, I can't do the thing with the muxy cup. God dang it. And let me try something real quick. Um. God dang it, god dang it, god dang it. This isn't working. I'm trying to do a thing. It's not working. That's not it. Well, that's no good. Yeah, I'll fix it later. Whatever. It's just gonna be a tiny little issue. Alright. Back to the game. Eh. Why you gotta whack me like that? Gonna kick your butt, gonna kick your face, gonna slap your face, gonna kick your face right into the wall. Oh yeah, I don't have to be as close to the microphone anymore. Oops, a little force of habit. Let me get my bells in front. Haha. -ha. You thought you could get to me, but you could not. Ho 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 ho. Let's hopefully hold out until Popoy can level up. No you don't. No you don't. No you don't. Kick your face. Kick your face. Kick your face in your face, outside your face, inside your face. Oh crap, wrong way. Oh shiz. Oh shizabiz. Shizabiz a whiz. Shizabiz a whiz a his a kid was a biz a biz a his. Oh, I leveled up. Well, guess I gotta use a little bit of magic. But hopefully, we can make it level up. Pow, right in Kissa. There we go. There we go. Okay. Get him in the face. Slap him. Boom. Yeah. Oh, crap. Dang it. Sorry, microphone's a little loud still. There we go. Now it's back to normal. Hmm. Whoa, that had to hurt. Going up. And down. Spawn, dang it. Boom. 
Boom, shakalaka. Well, I got prim. Yeah, right in your face. Dang it. Stop cheating. Well, you can't cure a dead body. Now let's get that whip and get ourselves across. Hello there, Sunbeam. Oh yeah, I did get a machinist job that I was planning on getting. So that turned out well. So I'm currently working at a company called Warren Scope Mounts. They make scope mount stuff. I can't exactly probably say what I'm doing due to non-disclosure. I can't really say how I make it either, because also, non-disclosure. And we're kicking some butt. Ouch! shy yi 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 Tuh. Yeah. Kick your butt. No. Well, I had to do get rid of that dude. No. No, 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 oh, bull crap. Now may get him revived. Oh, you cheap a hole. Got you midair. Hmm. Got something to say to me? Huh? There we go. Medical airborne fit. I'd feel like this would be a doorway. But I guess not. Eh, that worked. And... Boom! Shagalaga. Oh my god, it hurt. Rude, Sunbeam, rude. So why you gotta be so rude? Symmetry Medical. Eight. Oh, that's pretty interesting, making tools like that. Yeah, I'm just using large production machines. You can't barge in here, we gnomes won't allow it. What a windbag. Why, you little brat. Don't you love the cheesiness? Take this. <clears throat> wow, way off voice. This is an outrage. Oh, ho, oh, it's back. I'm out of here. Look, back there.
Time to spam some magic. Eh. Gotta spam. Oh no, you don't. Ooh. I'm gonna get you. Okay, why am I still quiet? I get get out of that habit of being overly courteous. Oh crap. Go. Gotta get him. Oh, crap. Gotta get that. Gotta not be engulfed. Okay. We're doing decently against this fire guy, I guess. Ah, uh, wrong way. Oh well. Yeah! Got him! Magic is useful. Yeah, Sunbeam is a lovely cutie, but he just likes to be a butt. Way to go! Got Axe's orb. Now let's go to the Mana Seed. Phew, thanks. That oaf was always bugging me. Forgive me, I took my rage out on you to get some relief. Dolt, you s serve me, and maybe I'll forgive you. Otherwise, I'll throw you to my servant, Randy. Hey, no, let me be your servant. Hey, who are you calling a servant? Oh dear. Anyway, call me anytime, anywhere. And close your eyes. Both you and your wife. <laughs> I almost forgot about that. May summon me. What? Me? Married to that? I like your style, gnome. Well, that's that. Be seeing you. Get gnome's powers. To the mana seed. Received the seed's power. Hey, Popoy. Ow! My head. You okay? Oh. What's wrong? <laughs> that face. Whew, I can remember everything now. We sprites live in the Upperland Forest. You got to take me there. I'll let you hang out with me until we figure out a way to get there. Gee, what a treat. Yeah, we'll get to that part. Anything to explore here? Not particularly. And the enemies are gone. So, safe to say, the palace is clear. Oh yeah, freaking needing the rope again. Or, whip. Dang it, wrong spot. There we go. Hopping on over. Ooh. 
There we go. Oh yeah, I was expecting some enemies to be there, but I remembered they're gone! And let's go through here. Oh yeah, I bought the items. I need to double check what I need to rebuy. One of those. Oh, I guess we did pretty decent. This song will get stuck in your head. Believe me, I am already there. Anything else? Let's sell these spares. 100 GP. Okay. Yeah, that sounds good to me. Mm hmm. Anything else? Uh, let me just double check. Uh, no. I think we're set for the moment. Be seeing ya. Let's check on the Elder and see if he has anything different to say. Sometimes NPCs change what they say. Oh, nope, same thing. Please take care of the little guy for me, okay? This was originally on the Super Nintendo, you are correct. There's Sunbeamy. Um, right. Let's go to Watts and upgrade a weapon. Okay, which one's ready? This axe will be taken to level two. It's a load axe. Let's see. Oh, hey. Gnome's magic. Oh, yeah. I need to kind of get a guys rested or get them fairy walnuts. 29. Eh. Hold on. Let's go right around here. Do this. Do that. Bada bing. Bada bang. Bada boom. And there we go. I know we should have a ranged weapon, but this will work just fine. What does that axe do? Effective against plants and fish. Well, that's good. I'm thinking of also playing Illusion of Gaia once I can actually get the uh, Zachman Rachmaninoff the third uh, persona going and everything. Right. Time to rest. And we're good. Oh, oh you're heading to bed? Well, good night there, Mecca. See you next time. Thank you for watching. Yeah. Now then, let's try and go to that uh, other place with the ruins and see if we can't actually, you know, proceed over there. Eh. Scarf, you're on my neck and you're making my neck itch. I'm trying to drape this over my shoulders, but the freaking scarf keeps sliding in different directions. Don't know why. It just does. It does that. It just. It it does that. I don't know. I don't know why. It just does a thing, and it gets on my neck, and it's warm. It's nice during the winter, but it kind of sucks during the summer. But it's a part of my look. Yeah, I'm just rambling about my scarf. What else is new? <laughs> Ba-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-
Yeah. Thank you there, Sunbeamy. It is indeed a very nice scarf. And how are we doing this? Okay. Cheat the system a little bit, why don't we? There we go. Yeah, the scarf was originally a part of a character's design. A character that's nicknamed Maddie from the Ask Mad Doctor Hooves .tumblr .com webcomic. I will be continuing that also in the near future. So, you can look forward to seeing more Maddie stuff soon. Especially if you're in the MLP fandom. But, the scarf just kinda decided to find its way onto my changeling in some fan art. And then it just kinda stuck as a part of my changeling's design. On uh, both the disguise form that you can see below in the chat, and his changeling form. The scarf is a nice addition. So, my changeling didn't originally have it until it was in fan art first. And here we go. Slap around the mush boom thing that can't knock me out anymore. Hey, mush boom, I guessed right. Oh, treasure chest. Mmm, delicious treasure. Candy won't fit, mm, son of a bitch. Dude, mmm, bite it. Bite out. Kick both your butts. Let's go this way! Another treasure chest. What can we find here? Mm, this, yes, and this mm, treasure mm, chest. Hey, back to Pandora. Yeah, you might seem inefficient just to shake around a box and throw it. But that's how Secret of Mana did it. And that's how it stuck. The master has been moping about ever since you took off, miss. Yeah. Apparently there's a servant in this house. Prim, you're back! Dad, I'm not coming back until I find Dylok. I was probably doing that dramatically, but I always kind of realized, I just realized over time, this game... It's like a template of cheesy RPG. But it's still unique in its own way. Um, yeah. And... Let's try this again. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh! There we go! She disappeared! But where? I have a feeling we'll find our answers in the ruins down there. Alright, let's save real quick, just in case you never know. If things could happen, bad stuff could happen to me, I could die and need to come back again. Whoa! That'll be 10 GP, buddy! Eh, nah. Save the game? Yes. Because everyone knows this is a game, apparently. It's the self-aware game, kinda. I don't know, it's just, it's just silly. Yeah, I certainly hope that the shopkeeper will be dancing in the remake. If 
Fanta says nothing. Prim, I'm going on a one-way trip. Pretty neat, huh? Come on, Fanta, snap out of it! Shut up. Stop bothering me. Oh, dear. Fanta? Fanta! Hey, you, make room! Unless we hurry, Fanta's a goner. Dalek's probably here, too. Yeah. Let's go into these evil ruins. Watch out! Ah, that tormenting music. Yeah, your magic didn't work there, buddy. Oh, crap. Use some of this magic. Yeah, defense is up. So now we can be a little more safe. Well, we could be fighting these zombies endlessly. Why did you go into the spray? Damn, and I did too. Well, I gotta use some magic. Yeah, go with that. Well, that worked. There's so many otters in my stream, I swear. Oh, great. Wanna fight an evil sword? Or two? Moon Saber. Yeah! Max reaches level one. Mm-hmm. No! Not speed down. Yeah, your defense isn't gonna last. Eh, why? Why you gotta do this? Eh, I'll just use this again. Yeah, level up. All right, he respawns. Adirp, adirp. Well, there's nothing in there. Is there anything in here? Nope, just three evil swords. Whack him! Whack him! Whack him! Oh my god! Whack! Whack a mole! Whack a sword! Whack a sharp object! Would you stop sapping health? God dang it, why are you being so offensive? I gotta change your level of attack. There we go. Ooh. Boom shakalaka. There we go. Yeah. The three of you chatting right now are all technically otters because one of your characters are. Yeah. 
And let's use another. Excuse me. Hey, kicked his butt. Let's go deeper. Oh, not these guys again. Ah, not this again. Use it. Dang it. Yeah, probably should. That worked. Thank you there, Moetti. There we go. Kicking butt and taking names. Oh, it actually works. It actually can be hit. Somehow. There we go. Smack your face, kick a zombie's butt as he's trying to do the thriller. Hey, it's another evil sword. Hey, I'm out of magic. I'll probably try and run back to get replenished since I don't have very walnuts right now. And I probably should make some healing. I'll use that again. Leveling up's a good thing. Hey, now I can make your attack stronger! Like so? Oh, jeez! Oh, jeez! Why? Why? You gotta be hitting me! With all that... Yeah... Let's just use a little bit of this, just because. Hey, there we go. I know I've gone through this part of the game without needing the magic to be high level. It does help a little bit, but I've been able to survive the boss with just the regular offensive of weapons and the sword fell from the sky and there we go <laughs> Yeah, it'll be a good boss fight. Just gonna make sure to charge up. Ch 
charge it up. Oh, that didn't work. Eh, let's get some candy on ya. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! You're trying to defend a frickin' treasure chest. What was that? Oh, medical herb won't fit. Well, that would've been a perfect time for it. Oh, cheesecake, sweet. Oh, well that's nice. Using your frickin' tomato man magic like that. Yeah. Let's just kinda... You're out of magic, almost. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'll just kind of exit out there. Proceed onward. Another one. Great. Frickin' spray attack. Frickin' tomato men everywhere. No doors. Great. The clouds, the mist. It is going everywhere. Who of you attacking him? Do I get anything rare? Let's see! A bomb! Shit! Well, as long as she doesn't get it again, we're fine. Oh, I don't want to get the box! Come on! Try that again. Try that again. See if we can level her up before she needs to get healed. Level up the prim. Hey, that's something for me. Hey, there we go. Hey, he got me some defense. Nice. Hey, we leveled her up. Didn't need to heal. Oh, my magic faded. How rude. Oh, crap. Yeah, gonna whack your face. Whack your fucking horn off. That sounded bad. Oops. Oh, great. Let's use a little bit of magic. Well, that, that's great. Just about out with her. Yeah, that worked. Who are you trying to cast to?
Oh, I remember Children of Mana. Children of Mana. It was a little bit different. And definitely a different style, more or less, of uh, what Secret of Mana is like. A lot of this, a lot of the Mana games in general, add a lot of different play styles. I mean, Legend of Mana, it was a lot more of a world you make by different magic items you set in a map that turn into places. Sword of Mana was a remake of the first Mana game, which was Final Fantasy Adventure, originally. But it's otherwise it got, it got renamed to Seiken on the uh, PSP remake. Welcome back, Nightfire. I'm not too familiar with Sia, but I'm thinking it'll be pretty fun and cool. Frickin' bomb. Oh, here's the area. Uh, let's see if we can... Nah, I probably should go back and replenish. Oh, no, I can't. Great. The door is locked. Well, if that's not a joyous thing to find out. Yeah, Mana series was pretty fun, but I kind of dropped off after Children of Mana. I didn't get any of the other games since I couldn't afford it or find the time to get them. But I probably will play those other Mana games and look on... Look to streaming those here as well. Yeah, let's get Popoy healed. Well, it's Thanatos. Thanatos, I presume? Indeed, I know all about what you've done. You're no ordinary fool if you can beat Eleni and her magic. Hand over Fana and Dylok. And make the people of the town as they were. Like that's gonna work. Ho 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 ho. What a spirited young lass. <clears throat> lass. I suppose this is Fana? Too bad, huh? I've drained her energy and now she's my faithful servant. I need life energy to create a new peaceful world order. Understand? Soon the Mana Fortress will bring the people of this small world together under my rule. However, it would be a shame to waste the talent you've already demonstrated. Surrender and you may serve me. Don't, and I'm afraid you'll only end up like him. Dialogue! Yes, he was a tough one. I believe Elni had a hard time with him, too. He must be recovering some kind of... receiving some kind of special inner power. A very unfortunate discovery. I'll never join you. Very well, then you can join the rest. And away we fall. Yay! Heroes of Mana, I think that was on the PSP. I know there was a bunch of different places where the Mana series showed up. My creation will be glad to entertain you. Your energy will be a feast to it. So let me read the chat real quick. Well, as far as the 3D remake for me in Moedi, I kind of think it'll be pretty interesting. It'll be different, but I'm interested in seeing a 3D style version of Secret of Mana since I would have been kind of curious how this would have played out as a 3D game anyways. Let's get that middle eye. Got it. Oh, right. Get the evil wall! Damn it!
Open your eye. Gotcha. I will say I did always love the, the sprites anyways. Ugh. Oh, that's bullcrap. Next time I'll replenish my magic. No, you cheap son of a bitch! Oh, come on, that was a hit. Ah, damn. Ah, friggin' spam! Let me heal! Well, let's get him some candy. There we go. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, you cheap mother trucker. Well, as far as kind of games I like, I like a variety of games. I like adventure, I like RPG, I like first person shooter, I like sci-fi, I like fantasy, I like steampunk, I like MMO, some MMO, some MMO. Oh, for God's sake. Yeah, this is great. I need to power up a little bit. Ah, no. I, dang it. Ugh. Frickin' run out of magic already. I wish you two allies weren't useless in this! Yeah, just knock out one eye at least. There, now you aren't being useless. Yay, this is taking forever. Ooh. Yay. Doing better. There, looking good. Hey, that sucks. Oh, crap. No! And there we go, gotta hit it again and again. And God dang it. No. Son of a bitch. Ah. 
Oh, come on! Right when I was about to do it! Every fucking time! You bitch! Eh, run out of magic already, damn it. Oh, no, I don't want that to happen. Oh, wait. Prim, let's do it. Well, they're getting his revives. And that hurt again. No! Yeah, really should have saved magic. Screw it, I'm going for the eye. That works. That's a lot better. I hate this wall. And this is going great. And every damn time. There we go. Now it's time to worry. There's a spike wall. Come on, work! Well, shit happens. Sadly, no trace of Randy Prim or even the Sprite Popeye was ever found. Yeah. Nice game over music. This is why I saved. However, I will go to buy some fairy walnuts and level up my magic a little bit. Because magic can make battle go a lot faster. So I'll just spam this a little bit right here. So leveling up two ways. There.
Skip that. And there we go. Right on Mr. Happy Face. I think Nekos is up here. I'm trying to remember exactly. And up here? Is this Nekos? Hey, it's Nekos! You and your overpriced everything. Really? <laughs> What'll it be? Let's shop. Perfectly priceless items available. Yeah, sure. Get a bit of that. One. I hate your prices. Yeah, gotta get it, just in case. And let's get out of that. Let's stay a night so we can get some of that mana back. And those fishes? Yeah, the fish have decent XP. But, yeah, I can probably just go over to Luca and save a little bit of GP. Hey, someone leveled up. Oh, level skill up. And to the sage. I'll restore you. Do you want to save the game? Yeah. Jim has not returned from Pandora yet. Something must have happened to him. And also, this is a reminder, if you want to join the Bug Hive, go to the above link for Discord. And if you want to donate or, or even send bits, we are now able to do bits since I'm now a Twitch affiliate. Bits are can be as small as one bit, and that's only one penny. So if you don't want to donate a dollar or five dollars, or do a five dollar subscription, which will get you down below over there, you can just go right ahead and still get a badge that'll show up in the chat down below. So the little bit of bits that you do send, they add up over time. And believe me, I love any support that is provided financially because, well, I'm doing this actually more or less for free at the moment. <laughs> and I would love for this to be a more of a daily thing. It might not be the same game every day because I want to have a special day to actually record a video for YouTube. But I probably have other general multiplayer days, so I'd be like hanging out and playing multiplayer. They're like, maybe Destiny 2 down the line, but I'm not getting Destiny 2 right away. Eh, yeah, let's go back up and get the fish, because I'm thinking I can just spam the fish with magic and then get myself restored easily. But any tips you do send, I will get the message, and they will also show up down there where it says tips. And if you are a subscriber on Twitch, Patreon, or GameWisp, you will also be credited down there where it says, subs. There we go. Spam time.
Now I can spam! You know, I could probably be also leveling up her magic. Ah, still. Oh, whoops, we're out. Man, itchy nose. Oh yeah, I could probably switch it over to uh, Popoy. Yay for spamming magic. Well, that's out. Yeah. That's true. I kind of forgot about that because I always thought that if you use the more powerful magic, the more experience you'll get, the faster you'll level up. That's what I kind of thought of in my childhood and it just kind of probably stuck and I never actually fully checked for sure. Gonna save the game in case I lose power. Because God forbid that happens. Let's go back to the fish. And you know what? There we go. Eh, let me do the thing. Yeah, speed down, level one. Oh, crap. Oh, it keeps me from using the other menu. And there we go again. There we go again. Whoop. And let's heal everyone. And let's go back. Persona 5. I haven't really looked into too much, uh, their Void Chaser. I... Usually when it comes to new games, I try not to get much for spoilers other than what I probably kind of see here and there on, like, Tumblr, or occasionally Twitch. But, I'd probably play that too at some point. I mean, if it's an RPG... RPGs can be pretty fun if they're done well and done right. But the designs are very nice and fun. Yeah, save that game. Yeah, we'll get to Gemma. Or Jima. Jima? I think it's Jima. So, usually if you ask me about, like, newer games, 
unless I looked into them a little bit, I'm going to be going into those games blind when I do get to playing them. Because they more or less, if they are worth potential, they usually get added to my list of games to stream. Here we go, spamming again. Keep doing that. And here we go. Hey, level two. Gonna hurt to keep leveling it up. Yeah, let's level up a little bit more. I ever played in the zombie games? Well, I have Left 4 Dead 2. I probably have Dead Island somewhere. And my roommate, Enzi, has a lot of the Resident Evil games. But, I have been told to get Dying Light. Ah. Dang it. Let's just do a little bit more. Level two. Dang it. Why you got to be butts? Why you always being butts in this area? And let's see if we actually get this to level 3 at all. Oh, is that level 3? Oh, no, it was a weapon skill up. Let's get that action up. And for her... Oh, get that to 1. Any, uh, MP left there? Oh yeah, a little bit. Oh. Wow, these are things I never checked in the game. I didn't realize that was the limit. Let me just take a peek. Oh, I see. Oh well. You know, is there anything better? I'll just use that. And that's enough of that. Very good. Very, very, very good. My first video game ever, I think, was Gyrus for the NES. Either that or Super Mario Brothers. Restoration. Yeah, so this is the fun grindy part. But 
my first games were on the NES since I was born in 1990. And after the NES for a little bit, like with Mega Man and so on, I got the Super NES, and at some point, I played Secret of Mana and fell in love with the game. Just the overall gameplay. I mean, I probably did remember that the orbs are limited based on how many mana seeds, but I haven't played the game in so long I didn't mem memorize all that as much as I love this game. But my favorite game, or favorite games, my top two are Undertale and Secret of Mana here. Yay, spam! Hey! Gotta level up. Don't you do that to me. Well, I still have a working Super NES and regular NES, and it's really nice to play the oldies like that. Um, right. Oh, I probably should have used this. Oops. And you use that one more time. Pardon me. I need to go over this way. Hey, Popoy, don't do that. Oh yeah, Ember the DOS. All those DOS based games. Like Laser Suit Larry! And a lot of kids games I don't remember the names of, but they were like story games. Those were pretty fun. There was like a lot of like... DOS... It wasn't like 8-bit or 16-bit, it was kind of like in between. It was like 16-bit-ish. Or 32-bit maybe, but... It didn't have any voice stuff, of course, it just was... Very chippy, chiptoony music. Oh yeah, I remember when I, my dad had to put in the code too. Now let's get the other magics leveled up. Oh, why don't I just spam this here? At least got this to like level one. Come on, get to level one. Oh, there we go. Let's get that restoration thing going. Yes, I know about Jima. I'll get there. At least level one.
Hmm, okay. Still taking forever. Cursed, net count to 99, based... Oh, there we go. That's better. Now let's get back to Pandora. And beat the evil wall. Thanks for the tips, Moetti. And there we go. Oh, sorry about the insomnia there, Mecha Spider. But welcome back. And there we go. Slap him around a little bit. To Pandora we go. Yeah, when it comes to games, I'm usually someone who likes to just play and explore a game and get used to it, usually, through the gameplay itself. And then later on, I look at, like, all the exact number stuff. I mean, I just prefer to kind of learn a game before researching a game at times. But if it's a, a particular game where you have to research, I don't know, it kind of takes a little bit away from figuring out a game yourself. I mean, it gets you through a process faster, but you don't have that learning experience. I guess that's why I usually don't look up guides unless I really need them. Let's go to that inn, just to get saved, just in case. And uh, note to that. And save the game. I played the hell out of this game for the longest time, and I haven't played it in a while, so replaying it just feels refreshing. Okay, Fana is already down there, so let's go. Oh. As far as where to see Doctor Who. Um, I am not sure about certain resources at this time, but I would say to ask uh, Jitty, uh, Jitterbug Jive at jitterbugjive.tumblr.com, J-I-T-T-E-R-B-U-G-J-I-V-E. -T -T -E -E. So, he'd be a bit of a better resource on where to, on a, on to ask where to find episodes, because unfortunately I haven't really been looking for episodes other than... <clears throat> Being a free pirate, you know. I already read this, so we can just kind of skip through here a little bit. Yeah, Netflix. Oh, Netflix has it over there? Well, they took it off our Netflix for their own streaming service. Yeah, it would be on Netflix if your country has it. Okay, gotta watch out. Now let's do a little bit of leveling up. Hey, thanks for the defense. Mwe. I'll get you. One way or another. Ow, oh, damn, that hurt. 
Oh, damn, that hurt. Friggin' spraying me! Hey, level 15. Yep, it's a grind, but it helps in the long run. At least you got different rooms to go in to grind. Hey, gotcha. There we go, got the axe to level two. Bada bing, bada bang, bada boom. Oh my god. Making comments about my booty. How dour you. Well, let's get past him since he wasn't doing much anymore. Well, hopefully if we stay over here, the other chest knight won't move. And it worked. Don't be a trap, but don't be a trap, don't be a trap. Hey, it wasn't a trap. There we go. And good times. Ow, oh, damn, went too soon. Huh. Damn you! Oh, you son of a bitch! And there we go. My best TF2 voice impression. I don't really know. I don't think I can do a spot on impression. But I like to do the medic, and I don't do them accurately. But I don't to do the scout, and I don't sound like a Mida. I can do the accent, but not the voice. And I don't do heavy other than this. Medic is also my favorite class. Hey, you didn't drop one. Double hit. Yeah, I'll just casually whack the zombies. Yeah, I kind of realized... Oh, damn, it's a bomb. When I played this game with my dad, I was playing as Prim the whole time, so I played Healer. And that's when I kind of learned, recently, for my whole life, I've been playing Healer classes when I have the opportunity. If I'm not playing Offensive Tank or whatever. I don't know, Healer just seemed to always fit. And we're whacking them. We're whacking them. Now well, that didn't do much. Damn it. There we go. Got you to level two now for your weapon. Well, at least my allies aren't getting... At least we aren't getting poisoned anymore. Oh, it's, never mind.
What's in the box? Oh, 96 GP. Sweet. Let me try and catch up in the chat a little bit. Well, that's a good reason to play that in uh, Destiny for one. Yeah, if you're good DPS, that usually means you'll make a good win. Because if you don't do good DPS, the support's only strong as your damage in your tank. Oh, hey, you got him. Oh, hey, you got him! Eh, let's respawn the enemies a little bit. Moon Saber, level zero! You can't poke me! I'm like decent at DPS, but I think I've always done better at a healer role. Oh. Well, this would be a good time to use your remedy magic. Well, that was useless. Grando time, old boy. Oh, that worked for you there, Tomato Man, didn't it? What I miss, what I get. Oh, medical herb won't fit. You can't keep doing this forever. Yeah, let's proceed. Oh, hey, it's a sword. Two swords. Hey, get over here. I need to hit you with my sword. We're doing decently. Oh, shit. Gotta try and level up a bit. Oh, damn. Well, that was nice. Is this the way? Yeah, I think it is. Oh, it's almost the way. Well, a nice team is always a blessing. So, yeah, if you do get in, find up finding a good team, that's always a great feeling. Come on, let's level up. Level up, come on. There you go!
I think we're doing decently. Shittle biddle. Hey, we leveled up. We get full point leveled up, and then we can go forward. I did nothing. Or did it. Smack it, smack it, smack it, smack. Just gotta smack it those zombies back. Oh, hey, thank you. Oh, nice. Not really. Yeah, this would be... Oh, hey, there we go. Come on, Pope Boy, level up. Try that again. A little more. A little more. Come on. Crap. You jerk. You can control any of the three characters, and that includes up to three actual players, but I'm not sure if I could ever get that working with the emulator. This game was originally one to three players, and you could just press the select button to change who you are, and you could be the healing spellcaster, or you could be the wise cracking sprite. Or you can just be the hero known as Randy. Trying to get freaking pull point leveled up, dang it. Yeah. Yeah. Kick your butt. But yeah, so Z SNES, so I would believe if I could have the ports available, I could probably get three people in total on here. Yeah, there's a config setting right up here for devices. At least port one and port two, so it could at least be two player. But let me just see. For input, well, you have three devices. So apparently that should work. Yeah, you always have to press start with the second controller, or third controller. One of you need to spawn something. Come on, level up, po boy. Let me just look at your friggin' XP so we can friggin' see this. Okay, we're right next to the level. Thank you. Now let's move on. We've had plenty of that. There we go! Thanatos, I presume. Indeed, I know all about what you've done. Yeah, we already read through this. So let's kind of keep moving forward. 
Well, you're an official buggy if you join the streams anyways, but if you want to become more of a very updated, up-to-date buggy, you can join the Discord server above, where it says FAH7ME, and you can just go on Discord and be a buggy. You will get the label buggy and be colored a nice changeling flame green. Thanks for following, Moetti. And away we go. My creation will be glad to entertain you. Your energy will be a feast to it. Well, let's do this again. Wake up! There we go! Ooh! Nice! This will be a quick boss battle. Wow, that was really easy. As far as recent episodes involving changelings, I have not seen any of the latest season yet, because and I need to. And I'll probably probably be doing that over the next few days and my days off. Got Bo's Orb. Oh, so you are the ones with the mono sword. You've ruined a plan that took months to build. I will not soon forget this treachery. The villagers are yours, but not these two. Wait, ah, Dylock, Fana. Till we meet again. <laughs> but yeah, I need to, uh. Hello, Prim. Where are we? Is Fana here? Where on earth is this? My head feels like a ton of bricks. Darn, I was doing my dishes. Yay, dishes, because that's what's important when you get brainwashed. What have I been doing all this time? Please inform the castle of this immediately. Oh, Gemma! Gemma, are you okay? Or Gemma? Gemma. Oh, Randy, sorry, I was caught off guard and captured. Thanatos is one of the Empire's top generals. It must be desperate to get mana. But why was he taking the village, taking the life energy away from the villagers like this? The Empire only needs the power of the mana seeds, not the people. There's something very disturbing about Thanatos. I've got a bad feeling about him. Anyway, let's get out of here. Return to Lucas Palace. Return to Lucas Palace. I'm off to check on the Underground Palace. Well, good thing I already did stuff over there. Oh, isn't this nice, happy music? Hmm. Well, I don't know what to say about stuff involving the changelings. Thank you very much. Oh yeah, that house that has armor and stuff. I'll get to that in a moment. Papa, Mama, back to normal! No matter what happens, I have to protect my family. For the sake of the children, I don't want more. Papa, Mama, back to normal!
Anyways, up to that special armor place. Everyone's back to normal. Oh, thank you. Hey. What'll it be? Yeah. You can always know the power of armor based on its price. I already got those. Yeah. You'll get these. Get the Cobra bracelets for everybody. Up to six, mm, yes. And here we go. Other way. I could have gone the other way. Oh well. All right, let's sell those things. Well, originally, thank you for following how many shadows. You are officially a buggy. As I say in the beginning of every stream, hello and welcome, buggies. Or at least I say, hey, buggies. That's what I usually try and do. Yeah. Get a hundred back for those. Anything else? Nah. Thanatos had cursed them and drained their life energy. So let's go back to the castle. Since we had to talk to the king about it, we had to talk to we have to talk to the king about what happened with the ruins. Well, I always bug people cuz I'm a bug. And to the king we go. Oh, they're in their bedroom, right. The king is shaking off his deep depression. Thank you, please come back. We all welcome you here in Pandora. King, wait. Hey, get up. Hey, oh, let me talk. Hey, let the king let me talk to you. You've done it, Randy. Things are returning to normal everywhere. What Jima said about the monosword and you was true. We must now part with our treasure. We've guarded these for centuries for you, wielder of the monosword. Oh boy, six treasure chests. Fifty GP? Okay. Found fifty GP. Loot's always nice. You gotta love the loot. Oh, Spears Orb. There we go. And Swords Orb. And 50 GP. And... Okay, that was just the cutoff version from after I got the treasure. Now, let's go back back to the underground village. Well, thank you there, Harmony. I will try to stream more in general, other than Mondays and eventual Tuesdays for the Doctor. You know, Doctor Hughes in costume, I mean, in character. Hey, orbs are helpful in this game. They make your weapons more powerful. Ah! Pathfinder, work. Scoot, please. Oh, you're still nice. I don't want to talk to you. Well, you never get nice people all the time, especially in this game. This is Pandora. Dr. Tuesday, perhaps. And I will do the in-doctor stuff on Tuesdays once the heat wears off on this weather a little bit. Or unless I can get the fans to work. And make sure I don't overheat. But I will work on Tuesdays soon as the doctor. 
Other than that, I'll just probably do casual multiplayer hangout streams on other days, if one not Mondays and Tuesdays. Mondays and Tuesdays, I plan to be for streams that get uploaded to YouTube. Every other day that I do a bonus stream, that's just stuff that'll be on Twitch, like Overwatch, or probably Destiny 2 at some point. Once I get Destiny 2, but for right now, I'm trying to save money. Thank you for following, El Changelin. Unfortunately, we don't have much for AC other than a little standing unit in the family room. So all I have in the bedroom here is a fan, an oscillating fan. So it does its job, but it still gets a little warm, and I do look forward to fall being cooler than this warm or hot summer. Oregon hasn't exactly fully planned for all the hotter summers we keep getting now. I mean, global warming totally isn't a thing. So... We'll keep moving forward. Well, if it came to consoles, I'd probably bounce between the PS4 and Xbox One. But I have a powerful PC now that can handle a lot of things. So I'm kind of mainly stuck in the PC for the most part. And it's a desktop PC, so that means I can upgrade the parts. And get more power to play with. Which I always love doing. Sorry. This chair makes my butt stiff. So I have to shift my seating. And there we go. Go on up. Stop swinging! Eh, I could probably play with uh, other magic for now. And you. I can. Hold on, I need to check something. What's your level? Oh, gnomes on one. Defenders two? Yep. Yeah, use that there. Well, that works nicely. Wait. I gotta get more. There we go. Yep. Well, that, I think, spent almost everything. Yeah, Blizzard is hosting it. I mean, hopefully, what it will be peer-to-peer, -peer, apparently, should work out fine if people have decent enough, uh, internet speeds. So long as the frickin' government doesn't try and censor stuff. Don't censor the internet. Free the internet. Free the internet! Alright, let's get some of those orbs upgraded. Let's head on down! Excuse you, Sunbeam! Okay, which one's ready? Yeah. A Herald Sword! Hmm, heavy spear! Now it's a Sprite Spear! Now that's leveled up, the short bow. Let's see what we can get for you. 37. Ah. Well, I guess. Level 2 axe is still good. Yeah, we're good. We're good.
Um, right. Do the thing. Ow. Oh. Hold on. Let me restore. Yeah. And of course, save, God forbid anything happens. Let's do this. And there we go again. Level up, dang it. Wing for that. Well, here we go again. Do it again. Not sure which class I'd play, I might do a tank or something in Destiny 2, but I'll have to look up the game again and find out more. What is your level at? 60. Whoops. Let's see what that does. Okay, it's 64. You're right. Eh, I'm sure that'll level up in time. Hmm. The thieves are below. Next, they'll hit the underground palace. I'll handle protecting the palace. You check this out. Keep alert, we don't know what lies below. What could be making a hole this big? Other than us dwarves, I mean. And here, we enter a couple of interesting, no, three interesting characters that will come to watch. Will come in contact more than once. What's this? Get Whip's Orb! It's very nice and steampunk, don't you think? Aha! The water seeds! How did you get in here? You realize we can't let you leave here alive. Welcome! We, the Scorpion Army, will soon rule the world! Check it out! Shut up! We took the water seed! To complete our super deluxe robot, we call it Kilroy! Hubba hubba! Do it! Aye aye, sir! Ah, the Scorpion Army. Such quirky characters. Domo arigato, Mr. Roboto. Domo, domo. Domo, domo. Go get them now. See ya. Farewell and goodbye, children. Hey, what's wrong? Too much energy. It's out of control. No, remove the seed. Use the auxiliary power. Well, let me try gem missile and see what that does. 85. Oh, crap. Oh. Well, then. I guess I'll go with this. Crap.
Aha! Ho ho! Well, hold on. Gotta use a uh, medical herb. Move there, Popoy. What about the version of this robot with the chainsaw? Oh, crap. Ah, uh, now we need to. Oh, never mind. Am I out? Yeah, I'm out. Ah, sh hi. Schnikes. Just use this once. Come on. Level two. Oh, come on, that was a hit. Oh, I wanted to get a hit on him. Oh, well. I'm trying to read the chat a little bit. Javelin's Orb. Not so well, see ya, bye! Let's get the Mana Seed back to the Water Palace. You're safe, somehow you seem older. J yeah, it's Jima took off with some Pandora soldiers. Was it Pandora or Pandoran? Pandoran. Now let me get some of the items replenished. Yeah. Let's do that thing. What'll it be? Get some of these. Do I need any more of these? Nope. Be seeing ya. Alright, let's get peeled up. An MP. Ah, that music. I think we're well off. So, while I still have some time left and I'll get some bonus time included, let's make our way to the Water Palace. Now it's level two. A javelin. Pulled out turned into a javelin. It's a black whip. Ew. Would that work better for you there, Purim? Or Prim? Sorry, I'm used to the Japanese name. Got ourselves doing pretty good. I think we can use a cannon travel to get to the Water Palace in plenty of time. Oh, well, see you later again there, Mecha Spider. Hope you get some sleep soon. 
See you again soon. Oh, geez, came out of nowhere. There we go! Kicked his butt. Ah, missed. There we go. Is this our way to the cannon travel? Kicked your butt. Our delivery for 50 GP. Water Palace, yes. Water Palace, have a nice fly, but just slide into the cannon. Yeah, I might go with a tank just to see how that goes because I don't know, people like to do mage and other stuff. I mean, mage would probably be fun if I had a party to go with. But I think just for sake of um progress, if I'm going solo, I might just go tank. So, what was that again? Titan. Probably go with a Titan. Unless I choose to be a warlock at some point. But I don't know, hunter if it also has some perks, it might be nice. Oh no, what's this? There are enemies outside the palace? Next to the palace? Why is this? You know, if we went to the water palace when the minus seed was stolen, Luca would have had some dialogue, but I forgot about that. Because I was just told to go to the underground palace. I didn't wasn't told to go to Luca. But Luca would have given you some guidance regardless. Oh god, you. What are you called again? What are you called? What's your name? Water Thug. Oh, the Thug Life. I see how it is. Hey, level 17. I broke 200. Oh yeah, the more serious end of the thick of it. I forgot what name, the name of this song is. But I like this version of the song. And when you do certain sound effects, it knocks out some of the instruments, so it's like a remix on its own. There we go. But what's ahead? Do we know? Luca, what? Get out of here fast! Well, well, now who have we here? I'm Gesta, personal guard of His Majesty, Emperor Vandal. Hand over that seed or Luca's had it. No, don't! Let's run for it. Fool, do you really think you had a chance in choice in the matter? Ouch, I can't move! Well, at least the seed's back to where it belongs. Too bad we have to break the seal on it. Stop it, you monster! You certainly are a rebellious bunch, aren't you? Disobeying an Imperial Directive these days is punishable by death. So long, rebel scum. So, let's spam some Undyne. Or maybe some gnome. Let's try gnome. Is that better? Oh, that's better. Shake that head. Shake it. Shaking my hair back and forth. Shake my hair back and forth. I shake my hair back and forth. I shake my hair back and forth. Oh, damn. Got chomped.
<laughs> well, that was nice and fast. Way to go! Got Boo's orb. Yes, more victory music. I brought the Pandoran army, and in response, the Imperial forces drew back. We managed to defeat their monsters in Pandora, too. I recovered this from one of them. You should have it. Ooh, got Whip's orb. Randy, we're running out of time. I'll return home and try to stop the Empire's plans from taking root there. Remember, only a restored mana sword will be able to beat them, Fortress. Talk to the cannon travel man near Potos. He'll send you to the Upper Land. I suspect the Seed of Air is somewhere in that area. Find it, and fast. Woo! That means I'm going home at last! Now, use your sword to restore the seal put on the seed. Yeah, restore that seed. Received the seed's power. Pure evil seeks the seed now. You must hurry and revive the mana sword. Go to the lofty mountains and seek out Sage Jock to learn more about real courage. Then travel to all eight of the world's palaces and reactivate all the seeds. You'll be able to receive mana power from the seeds once you reactivate them. I have business with Sage Luca. Good luck and Godspeed. They believe in a god! Restore and save the game. You must never lose hope. Well, it's about seven, so it's about that time where I have to do the farewell. And thank you to everyone who came and donated and followed and watched and subscribed. But if you ever want to subscribe to my Game Wisp and get a Twitter shout out, a Twitch follow, and a comment in here, as well as a Patreon label as a Wisp Buggy. You can go to my Game Wisp, which is linked below. It says subscribe. It looks like a little cool eye thing. And if not that, you want music on occasion, I also have my Patreon. Also for $5, you will get music, and you will get any... And you will get your name as well, down there, where it says subs. But of course, bits and tips always get a thank you. And are always here and down there in the tips. So you know where to follow me. I have all my social media down in the links below, as well as always in that bottom left corner. So other than that, praise the Spurple. You can't see her right now since she's in the darkness. But as I say from the darkness, darkness, my old friend, I've come to talk with you again. And I must say to you, no matter the time of day, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. See you guys next time. Love you very much. Save this. Do this. So see you guys next time. And I will be oh and be sure to join the bug hive if you want to be up to date and whenever I stream. See you guys soon. Whoops, hold on. Gotta do the thing. <laughs>